and welcome to my channel. So today, before I get started, I just want to talk to you guys a little bit. Um, last week, <laughs> I made an entire vlog, but I put it on different settings than what I usually do, and the entire video is like really, really shaky, so I couldn't even post it, which is kind of dumb. But regardless of that, I haven't been posting as much as I usually do, and I feel like this is because I like... Not that, it's not even that I've grown bored of YouTube or like the idea of YouTube, it's just that I kind of, I feel like I'm just making videos to kind of draw views in rather than, than just doing things that I actually like. Like, yeah, I like talking about hair, yeah, I like doing clothing hauls and doing that kind of stuff, but at some point it gets kind of boring and I just want to kind of like do what I want to do, you know? Like, is that weird? I don't know. I just feel like I'm not being true to myself or true to what I want to do and this is a hobby for me this is like I'm clearly not a big youtuber I'm clearly not like anything so this is just more like my hobby to me so why don't I just do what I want to do and not worry about like views so I'm gonna stop worrying about that and I'm just gonna start making videos that I want to do and things I'm interested in at the moment anyway to what I was actually wanting to talk about in this video it's this soap this skin whitening or skin lightening soap um I don't really like to think of it as a skin like you know whitening soap because that just sounds so bad but that's basically what it is so it's this soap it's called Koji San and it looks like this and I'm sure if you've ever been interested in any kind of like soap or any kind of anything to help you lighten your skin this has probably been mentioned once or you've seen it before but yeah so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing like before and after pictures and I'm going to be coming back like in a month from now like not that long because I've been taking I've been using this for like a week I'm wearing makeup right now which I shouldn't have worn makeup but I'm wearing makeup right now so you probably won't be able to tell but I've been using it like on my neck and face area because my neck and face area are so much lighter than my chest area like I don't know if you can tell like, I'm just trying to not get my cleavage in here, but <laughs> I don't know if you can tell, but it's like so, like the color, the, the contrast is whatever. Um, I'm wearing makeup on my face, so you're probably not going to be able to tell clearly, but it's just like the contrast is so bad. So I've been trying to like kind of correct that. And for me, like I always wear like t-shirts. It's from when I wear that and then my clearly my neck and my face are out and so they're darker. But I just really don't, it's like something that bothers me so much. Um, I don't know why it bothers me so much, it just does, like, just being able to, like, when I want to wear kind of, like, low-cut tops or anything, you can definitely tell, and I feel like other people can tell, even though they probably aren't caring, you know, but I can tell, and that's all that matters to me, so I'm trying this out. Basically, this thing, it comes in a pack of two, and I have another pack, but I cut it up, so I'm not using that to show you guys, but this one's the unused one. And so I, I cut the other one up into like tiny pieces, not really tiny, but like into their own little cubes so it can last over a longer period of time. And I think that's a really good idea. If you're getting this, definitely cut it up because mine has been laughing, lasting for like a really long time. I am hoping that after a month of using this that I'll be able to have some noticeable differences. I have taken pictures and... I'm going to be able to use them hopefully for some dramatic like before and after. The main thing, my main goal is to lighten my neck area because my neck is like the main part that is like really like off from my face and my chest area. It's like the darkest out of like you know the three areas that I'm like kind of like focused on. And so I'm really hoping that it helps my neck area and I've specifically taken pictures of my neck so I can have those pictures in the before and after. But yeah, I'm not really, like, I'm not trying to encourage at all, like, skin lightening or anything. But I feel like if there's any discoloration or anything like that, then, and you want to correct that, then, like, go for it, you know? Like, there's so many creams out there, like the Ambi cream and stuff, that just kind of, like, help you with these things. And, like, I don't really get acne. I don't really have dark marks or anything. So that's not really a worry for me. But I do have discoloration and hyperpigmentation on my body. And so, yeah, I'm going to want to correct that. If I'm getting in the shower, if I'm getting in, like, the tub or something, anything I'm going to do with water, maybe even just waking up and doing a face wash, I will get a one of the cubes of soap that I have, you know, pre-cut. And I will wet my face, I will wet my neck area, and I will rub this soap in. I will rub it all over on my neck, everywhere, my face. And I will let it sit for one or two minutes. Um, 
I think I might be boosting it up a little bit just to see if I can get better effects. And I read somewhere that if you keep it on a longer amount of time, the effects will be more dramatic. So that's what I'm going to start doing. Maybe that's why I haven't been seeing any like dramatic results yet. Because people report seeing results in as much as a week. But I've, have, I've seen like slight results, but not like anything crazy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be putting on for a longer period of time. But basically, if you're just trying to get rid of dark marks or just make your skin even, I would keep it on for like one to two minutes. But if you're trying to like lighten your skin or get rid of some kind of discoloration like in a big part of skin like that is bigger than like a pimple dark spot then definitely try to keep on for like five to eight minutes I think that would be best but yeah so that's what I'm going to be doing and I am going to be making a video for you guys at the end of my journey with this soap and hopefully I have some awesome before and after pictures so you guys can see that the soap does work or that it doesn't and I'll be doing a review on that for you guys but yeah um like and subscribe if you guys want to be updated on this whole journey if you're interested in this soap don't forget to like ask some questions about it because I'm here you know I will answer any questions you need as always thank you for watching and I love you guys bye